Hello guys, are you recently looking for a solar telescope? Or if you are looking for an equipment to view solar eclipse? Do you want to know what these telescopes are capable of showing? Or if you want to know if these are safe to view solar events? If you have any of these questions, please stick around for an in-depth review of Celestron Eclipse Smart Solar Telescope. This is Rahul from astroshootingstars.com. If you are new to my channel, please click on that like and subscribe button and hit that bell icon to get notifications for all my new videos. Celestron Eclipse Smart Solar Telescope. It's a small and a lightweight telescope. Except for the main tube and optics, everything is made out of plastic. Overall build quality seems to be nice and above average. It's a very cheap telescope at around 100 US dollars. It is an f7.5 refractor telescope with 50mm aperture and 360mm focal length. It comes with an ISO certified solar safe optics with inbuilt solar filter which makes it very safe for viewing sun and solar events. It comes with a rack and pinion focuser. Tube and the focusing wheels are made out of plastic. It does the job when it is used with an eyepiece but it cannot hold the weight of a camera and can slip. With an eyepiece, it requires an extension of the tube to a large extent. With a camera, you might require an additional extension to get the right focus. It has a 0.96 inch tube and hence cannot accept the normal 1.25 inch eyepiece directly. And you might require an additional adapter or diagonal provided with the telescope to use it. It comes with the solar safe viewfinder, which I believe is a nice addition to this telescope which makes this telescope very safe to use and point directly to the sun without actually looking at it. This is done by casting the shadow of the top point of the pin to the center of the target. Once the shadow of the pin is directly aligned to the center of the target, you know your telescope is aligned and ready to view the sun. It comes with a 20mm Kepler eyepiece, which is a standard eyepiece of 1.25 inch and has a field of view of around 2.25 degrees and provides around 18x zoom. This telescope also comes with a 90 degree mirror diagonal, which helps you view the telescope comfortably from the top instead of viewing it from behind, which also duals the role of converting 0.96 inch tube to 1.25 inch tube, which then can be used with any standard eyepiece. It comes with a nice sturdy altazimuth mount tripod which comes with a quarter inch standard screw which gets directly attached to the telescope. This tripod legs can be extended so as to give you a comfortable view from the telescope while standing. Although this tripod does the job but in my opinion it is very difficult to keep track of the sun using this kind of mount as the slightest movement can throw off the sun completely out of the view. My recommendation would be to use an equatorial mount or a tracker with this kind of telescope for viewing the sun. Here is the live view of the sun from the telescope using the camera. If you look closely, you can see the dark spots on the surface of the sun, also some of the minor activities that is happening on the surface of the sun. But you cannot use this telescope to view the solar flares or plasma or any of the solar activities happening on the sun. Here is the stacked image of the sun taken from this telescope. Here you can clearly see the solar activities and the dark spots on the sun. How do you like this telescope? Please let me know in the comments below. If you have any questions or comments, please drop them in the comment section. I will try and answer as soon as possible. And if you have not already subscribed to my channel, please like, subscribe and share this video so that I can make more of these kind of videos for you guys.